pressure comes. Oh, don't show me. Hey guys, what is going on? Here's my live reaction to the New York Giants versus the Kansas City Chiefs game. Third and goal for the Chiefs. They're on the Giants five yard line. Ball is snapped. Mahomes drops back. Giants bring three. He has time. He steps up. He's going to throw. Whoa. Oh, it's flicked in the air. Interception. Let's go. Let's go, Xavier McKinney. Let's go. No, it's Julian Love. It's Julian Love. Sorry. Julian Love. He came up with it. I thought Xavier McKinney had it. And Daniel Jones just threw an interception two plays later. And the Chiefs are back in the red zone. So it's like that Giants interception actually never happened. Third and goal for the Chiefs. They are on the Giants. Six yard line. I am nervous. Mahomes drops back. He has time. He steps up in the pocket. He avoids the sack. Throws it. End zone. Touchdown. Yikes. Tyree Hill. Chiefs are about to go up 7-0 with the PAT. Fourth and goal for the Giants. Here we go. I am scared. They are on the one yard line. Jones is under center. He fakes the handoff. Throws it. End zone. Touchdown. Kyle Rudolph. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. It's going to be a tie game if they hit the PAT. First and goal for the Chiefs at the Giants 3. I am scared. Mahomes is under center. Snap. Hands it off to Gore. Oh, he's like going to get in so easily. This is what I predicted in my pregame preview. I said the Chiefs are going to run the ball. And I said that's what they're going to do. And that's how they're going to score. Because the Giants have a bad run D. It's going to be 14-7 Chiefs with 6.37 left in the second quarter. Here we go. Third and four for the Giants in the red zone. They're on the Chiefs 8-yard line. 3.09 left in the first half. They are down seven. Ball snap. Jones rolls out. Throws it. Oh, they're short. Why do they throw it short of the sticks? Here is Gano for the 23-yard attempt. Hold is good. Kick is good. Giants are still down. The score is 14 to 10. Chiefs lead. 245 left in the first half. Third and four for the Giants. They are on the Chiefs five-yard line. My hands are literally sweating. I'm sweating. I'm nervous. I'm not having fun because I am so nervous. Ball snapped. Jones drops back, pressure comes. Oh, touchdown, Ingram. Please tell me there's no flags. No flags, let's go. Oh my gosh, I thought there might have been a holding call. Oh, oh my gosh, guys. I'm literally not enjoying this because I am so nervous. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be 17-14 if they hit the PAT. Oh my gosh, this PAT is huge to make it a three point game. 14.53 left in the game. Second and 20 for the Chiefs at their own 19 yard line. 4.29 left in this game. It's a tie game right now. Did anyone move on the Giants early? I got scared there. Oh, they did. And they're throwing it down the field and it's an interception, but they moved off sides. They moved off sides, but it's an interception. Are you kidding me? It's not gonna count. Oh. I wanna cry. I wanna cry. I know it's gonna be a... I see, it's offside. Are you kidding? See, it was probably thrown because Mahomes knew he had a free play, but... I don't like this. Third and goal for the Chiefs. 156 left in this game. It's a tie. They are on the Giants. Eight yard line, I am so nervous. I am so nervous. Ball is snapped, Mahomes drops back. Giants bring three. Oh no, Mahomes is rolling out. Get the sack. Yes, sack. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. All right, they're gonna go for the field goal though and the Giants have no timeout, so the clock is gonna run down. Okay, it's still not a good situation, but there's a glimmer of hope. Here is the field goal for the Chiefs that will put them ahead. Miss, okay, it, it made it. Ugh. All right, the Chiefs are up 20 to 17, 107 left in the game. Giants have no timeouts. I'm getting deja vu of the Vikings Cowboys game last night where the Vikings have no, had no timeouts. Second and seven for the Giants at their own 28 yard line. 101 left in the game. They are down three. Ball is snapped. Oh my gosh, pressure is coming. Jones, sir, no. Why are you taking that sack, bro? No. It's going to be third and like forever. Clock is running 50. 49. Why would you take that sack, bro? Oh, gosh. Third and 15. I'm gonna cry. No, I'm not, but my heart is literally broken. Okay, Jones drops back. Pressure comes again. Oh, it's gonna be fourth and 15. Fourth and 15 for the Giants. This is the game. This is the game. Ball is snapped. Jones drops back. Pressure is coming. He's gonna get sacked again, isn't he? Yeah, and he fumbles. Oh, and it's over. Of course, it ends on a fumble. That's the game. Giants lose by three. Uh. I'm sad. This is the thing, guys. This is the thing. No man could ever break my heart because I am a Giants fan. 
I have already been through so much heartbreak. My heart gets broken like every single Sunday for the past five years. A man thinks they can break my heart? They literally can't. It, it's impossible. It can't happen. I actually had my hopes up for this game. Bruh. Bruh, that sack. So there we go. Yet again, penalties, undisciplined play, and coaching mistakes cost the Giants the game. Wow. I mean, the taunting penalty, what was that? The use of timeouts was absolutely terrible and put the Giants in a bad situation there at the end of the game. The play calling on offense was atrocious at times. This one stings. I can't even lie. This stings. And yeah, I don't even, I don't even know guys. <laughs> I don't even know what to say at this point. They're two and six. It's a disappointment. It's a huge disappointment. And it's honestly just terrible. This team is not good. This team is not a well-coached team. This team is not a good team. They can never close out these games. So yeah, the Chiefs just played better. That's the difference between Daniel Jones and Mahomes. I don't need to call Daniel Jones out here. I'm not putting this loss solely on him. But when the game is on the line, who was able to put their team in the winning position? It was Patrick Mahomes. Yes, I know the Giants were without a lot of wide receivers and such, but that's just the difference of when you have a franchise quarterback and one of the best quarterbacks in the league, they are able to step up when you need to win the game, when the game is on the line, and they're able to, to win, and that's what good teams do. They win these games. So that is it for this video, guys. Make sure you drop a thumbs up. I heard um, if you drop a thumbs up, uh, every thumbs up, it helps my broken heart heal a little bit. So yeah, I don't know. If you wanna, if you wanna do that, um, and subscribe, guys. Peace. Ball a snap. Eli, I mean, Eli, I just called him Eli.